good afternoon. It is, oh my God, I don't have my watch on because it's dead and I don't know where I put my charger. So I think uh, it's Thursday. Yep, because Jersey Shore Family Vacation comes on today. You bet you're sweet, but I know that. Ha <laughs> ha. So anyway, it's Thursday. I'm doing a week keto update. Um, I just left the gym. Oh, it's also 5.46 in the nighttime. Um, I just left the gym, and then from the gym, I dropped some stuff off to Goodwill in my town, like some old clothes and stuff. Um, and now I'm on my way home to make dinner. I'm going to make tuna, but like I bought tuna fish, like a, like a slab of tuna fish, you know, and I'm going to cook it. I'm going to barbecue it. Um, I'm going to do that over some cauliflower rice. Um, I feel amazing. Literally feel amazing. I can't really, I mean, I've lost about three pounds, but I don't feel like I want to put pictures out yet because there's not that big of a difference in like, I mean, all, my clothes fit better, but like there's not that big of a difference in, um, like my, sh you know, my shape. I don't know. I just like three pounds. I'm happy about three pounds, but like I'm seeing, I just don't, I mean like I, as far as a picture, I don't know if you'd be able to tell yet. So, um, it, it, the more weight that comes off, I'll do like a, you know, how much weight I've lost video, but, um, yeah. So, um, I feel amazing though. Honest, honest, to Jesus. I feel amazing. I have a lot of energy. I stay relatively full. You know, I don't feel like I'm lost anything, you know, I mean, except for bread. I do love me some bread, but I mean, you know, it's okay. I'm willing. My boyfriend has celiac disease, so it's kind of, it's kind of okay. Not eating bread. Cause like he can't eat bread, you know? I mean, he eats gluten-free bread, but I'm not a fan of that stuff, so. But yeah, I feel amazing. I have so much energy. I I just I just feel really good. My headaches have gone away. I used to have really bad headaches. I'll make a separate video talking about all of my trials and tribulations of life and why I chose the keto diet, you know. My best friend's not doing so great because that, that, that bitch loves carbs. She loves carbs carbs so I just stopped in actually and visited her earlier or on our lunches but I saw <laughs> I dropped her off um, a tea I usually we go to lunch once a week and then I stop in a couple times a week and take her a, a tea from Starbs and she was she, you know it's hard at first it's hard making a big lifestyle change I know that like you know, there's a bunch of different theories on it or people saying like, oh, whatever, you know, it's not good for you or this, just do this and this will work or blah, 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 blah. But realistically, like, it's hard making a change, you know, like people don't understand when you're so used to eating a certain way, you know, so, and she loves carbs. I love carbs too, but since I've been like on a weight loss journey, I have like seriously cut back on stuff like that. And I mean, I'm not vegan or vegetarian or anything, but like throughout the day, this man is like doing some serious tricks on a skateboard. You go homie. Um, throughout my day, like starting like breakfast to dinner is mainly plant-based. Like I eat a lot of vegetables throughout the day. Since I've been on the keto diet, I don't eat as much fruits as I did before because like you can't have as many fruits like blueberries a, a little slight amount strawberries a slight amount but like I don't eat as much fruit as I used to but still mainly like I eat a lot of veggies throughout the day a lot like I hardly ever pair meat in my breakfast and lunches what are you doing thanks so much for deciding to turn God. um but yeah my dinner is where I eat like my my meat source of protein but throughout the day like I still get protein and other things you know but yeah um that's my update that is my update I'm feeling great I've lost three pounds um 
and I want to keep going. I'm, it's, I'm only a weekend, but I want I want to keep going. I want to see how far I, I can go. I love to challenge myself, but from this challenge, I've felt really great. I, the outcome of it has been amazing. So I did have a couple days there where like I've heard people talk about the keto flu. I did have a couple days where I was like bad, like nauseous, just not feeling good. Like literally feeling like I had the flu. And I think that's the keto flu but I mean could have been could have not been I don't know but I definitely wasn't feeling too hot there for a little bit but as of now I feel bitching okay I feel on it I feel rocking I feel great so I will keep keeping you guys updated um but now I'm gonna go home and cook me some tuna Ooh, ooh. Keto Guido, Keto Guido, Keto Guido.